Hello chaps, Benny Boy here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create a stems file to use in Tracks Pro software to help take your mixes to the next level. I'm going to be using FL Studio, but you can do this in any door you like. But if you are a fellow FL Studio user, you can click the link in the description below and subscribe for free to my Patreon and get access to this template along with many other goodies and uh, this should really help speed up the whole process. The first thing I'm going to do is open up a free piece of software called Splitter. I'm not going to go in depth in how to install this, but what I will do is I'll leave a link below to Dylan Tolshi's video who does an excellent job of explaining exactly how to install it and get it all up and running. We want to make sure we've got four tracks selected and find the song we want to extract the stems from. I'm going to be using What Would You Do by David Guetta, Joel Quarry and Bryson Tiller. And once our track is selected, we're just going to let Splitter run and do its thing. In the meantime, I'm going to open up iTunes and drag the song file into the master track in FL Studio. And once Splitter has finished doing its thing, we're going to go and find the output folder in the FL Studio browser and drag each file into the corresponding track in FL Studio. Splitter will create a little click at the start of all of the tracks, which is used to ensure all of the stems are aligned. Now all of our tracks are already perfectly aligned so we can get rid of this little click and once we've done this we can sync all of our stems up with our master track and once everything is perfectly aligned we're going to come up here to save as and create a brand new folder and name the folder as well as the project file after the name of the song. Once we've done this we're going to go back up to file then to export all playlist tracks from track start. Once we've done this we want to find the folder we just created press open and press start to export all of our tracks into the folder. Once everything has finished exporting, we want to open up Stem Creator, which is a free piece of software created by Native Instruments. I'll leave a link to that below and we can start opening up all of our stem tracks. I'm going to open up the folder we just created and drag each stem into the corresponding slot in the Stem Creator software. I'm going to rename the Synth slot to Other just to keep everything consistent. And once that's done, I'm going to open up iTunes and simply copy all of the track data into Stem Creator. And finally, we can go to the bottom right here and click export. I'm going to export it into the same folder we created, paste in our name, and then we can click save. And that is it. Our file is now ready to open up in Tractor Pro and we can start using it in our mixes. I hope this video helped. Like, comment and subscribe. Go check out my Patreon, linked below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.